Ah, and here he comes, Odysseus, a champion of Atlantis, sent to fight in my army. Join us, Arcantos. You know the famous Odysseus, surely. I know of him. Your reputation precedes you. As does yours. Are you ready for the siege? We could use your advice in planning our attack. As the commander here, I have already taken care of the plans, Odysseus. You and Arcantos will take your armies and start the siege of the gates. That's a fine start. What about the other armies? Ajax and I will keep our men in reserve. When you get through, Ajax will rush his men in to clear out the Trojan defenders. Then I will enter and rescue Helen. Of course you will, Agadennon. Steal all the glory for yourself. What a guy. Alright, this is a, it's a challenging mission, this one. Sir, there's no gold nearby. We'll need to find and take over one of Troy's mining operations. Right, first things first, we need a couple of fishing ships and we need a transport ship. These guys can deal with the archers on this island. And we basically need to take care of Pink. If you take care of Pink and this uh, mission becomes a lot more manageable. So this relic gives us a um, uh, faster fish gather rate, which is huge. Here's the gold we need. Into the transport ship. This guy's come off faith or uh, favor. So we need to build a fleet. The fleet is what is going to allow us to take down Pink relatively easily. I say relatively because it's not the easiest to take down this early on in the game. But we do have enough. We will have enough. I'm going to take these down just because they give us um, gold as a resource. We're mostly going to be building juggernauts. Juggernauts are fantastic at taking down buildings. Well, I say fantastic, they're, they're, they're decent. Once Red finishes attacking me, I will be able to send an army over. We're getting our limits. It's a pretty decent fleet. Right. This should be what we need to take down these. Basically, there's three buildings we need to take care of from Pink. And those three buildings are the two docks and an archery range. That prevents them from sending any more units to attack us for the remainder of this game. They don't rebuild the um, buildings, so we just need to take care of them initially. I'm waiting for Red to attack us as well. I'm just going to build 
couple of archery ranges because archers are really what we're going to be using from an army perspective. This is the attack I was waiting for. Now eventually Pink will um, create mythic units, a Scylla I believe, which is basically a Hydra on water and we need to take this down, the docks down before that happens because they will absolutely decimate our uh, fleet. Now we actually don't need to focus heavily on um, any more ships so we can focus instead on food. Fishing boats. So my army decides it wants to offload up on loads. So this is the exact attack that we're looking to avoid. So now they've sent most of their units out, we can take on their base before they have a chance to build up their army again. This will be fine, we're not going to take down our town centre with just a bunch of archers. It will just be annoying with killing my villagers. This is the building we need to take out. And I also want to grab this because it has a small trickle of gold, which in this mission is very important. That is what we need to do. We can retreat, get out of here. Peace out, if you will. I'm actually going to send these guys down here. So they don't get attacked. What are we doing on this mine? Yeah, plenty. I'm just going to pop these here. Just to be annoying. That is bad timing. That is very bad timing. Oh, very annoying. going to start building some farms. We want to upgrade my toxitas. really is the thing I need to get the most of right now. Oh. 
This is the only challenge with taking uh, Pink out so early is the uh, you don't have a huge amount of arm, big army to deal with this early on. Enough, but it's not ideal. take over the gold mine but that's going to be very difficult right now so instead I'm going to focus on food wood I think pretty much there Good amount of gold because of that gold mine. Next. Next. I'm going to want to build this armory. Start our upgrades. Defend this as best we can, really. It's not a good uh, situation like that. Like at this point, we've got enough to deal with this. Beautiful. Right now, I do want to look at um, leveling up or raging up so we can start upgrading troops even more. At this point, we're strong enough that we can actually start pushing out and trying to grab this. Actually, pretty close to being proper maxed out. We are going to want to start popping off their traders, but it does also encourage them to attack us more. So just wait to hit a critical mass of troops. Actually, that's probably not going to help us that much.
should sage up. I'm gonna go with Dionysus. A couple of reasons, main one being Hydras. Hydras are insane. Get a couple of them on our side and we'll cook in. I'm also gonna want to put a couple of people on this as well. Just so I can start getting some uh favour. build a marketplace so we can start trading resources for gold because even at this point gold is a uh, is a big problem it's a very big problem a trade caravan this supplies troy with gold we can put a stop to that Reinforcements! Yeah. We've got to protect our trade caravans! The more caravans we destroy, the fewer troops the Trojans will train. To be fair, on this difficulty, it doesn't seem to make a huge difference. Like, it helps, for sure. It's not something I would put a huge amount of stock into. But you're right, it, it does kind of slow them down a smidge. We're mostly just doing upgrades at the moment. We need to uh, sell some wood. Normally they just auto target villagers, so constantly having to rebuild them. I'm going to start getting some upgrades. In fact, we should probably go for this, which makes it easier to hit moving targets. And they, the enemy tends to favour cavalry a lot. Which makes them a really good choice for us. I think at this point we could probably take a few people off of this and put them into gold. Once the enemy attacks again, we'll start pushing out. Next stage that's going to be difficult with the gold that we have. Hydra's getting pretty strong with his, I think, all four heads now, actually. Take down this mining camp next. 
build ourselves with forts. So we're at the point where we've got that critical mass now of uh, Toxitase. You know, good enough upgrades that they're actually starting to do some serious damage. Starting to get pretty good income. So actually sieging this down is going to be very difficult. We kind of need definitely a couple of what I would call mangonels. And that's probably worth us saving up for, to be honest. Definitely at the point now where we're just fully maxed out. The only thing we can really do is upgrade. At least until we trade off some of the other less powerful units. Mind out. Right, let's go grab these guys and pop them there. Festus. That's it. Using these are very annoying. I kind of wish units would move faster. It's whenever they're grouped, they just take forever to move. Pro 
Σταγμά, λέγε. Ναι, βούλοβε. Πρόσε, μάλιστα. Ε, λέγε. We do need to be careful here, this isn't going to be a straightforward run in kill. We do need to uh, need to break through, we need to start doing some damage to the enemy. Otherwise I just keep relentlessly attacking us. And to be fair, we're kind of at the point now where we're kind of headed towards our max. So we're going to reduce the cost. Plenty is huge, gives us triple three three per second of all resources. Especially huge in this particular mission. There's also a cheaper armory upgrades here, which I can forgot about to be fair. It's pretty good to pick up. Team two shooting buildings while team one takes care of all the units. The Greeks seek to destroy our market. If we lose our trade it'll hurt us badly. Yeah well Pull back. Hydra. Great by Toxotase, Champions. So good. Focus okay, this down next. Lost his focus down the gates. mission.
Galantian and Odysseus dare to attack us! Oof, what a mission. Defend! Troy will never fall! Say that. Now nah, it's not the easiest thing to take out. Quite the mission there, quite the mission. The gate is down. Now that was a fun mission. This is the this is why Titan's such a good difficulty, because it's uh leads you to some very challenging missions, which is what we want. We don't want it to be a straightforward steamroll. But let me tell you, if Pink was attacking us at the same time, woo! Yeah. That's why you take out pink early on to give yourself the breathing room to just take on one one opponent rather than two. Anywho, folks, that'll right about do it for this video. I hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, please do give it a thumbs up. If this is the kind of content you enjoy, then please do consider subscribing to the channel. It does help support the channel and would be greatly appreciated. Do let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And as always, I shall see you in the next video.